split his camp half in Beleng and half with his brother. His brother had duties elsewhere. Right here, you see when that 50-50 position is about who controls the underhook. The guy that controls the underhook is going to be the one that has his back to the open. See, Figueredo has the underhook here. It's going to be on Rivera to try to use his left arm to come back inside and try to turn Figueredo off of him. Nice sneaky up el uh, elbow there from Figueredo. Ferro keeping them locked up at this stage. Wanted to disconnect on his own terms. Just missed out on that elbow. You see Rivera more calm and patient than he was in his fight against Tyson Nam. Right? That was one of the things that he wanted to correct. He felt like that's why he found himself in trouble in that fight because he didn't follow the Oof. plan. Obviously, he fought, he fought the fight on short notice. He knows that he is so much better than what he showed in his UFC debut. Oh my God, how much does... Francisco move and tripped with his right foot at the same time, a twisting motion that allowed him to get to that position. Well, Rivera working from his back here, though. Yeah, got that arm trap. It looks like Figueredo is going to get it out. And there he goes. Good work. Hey, Figueredo has to be careful here because a lot of his submission and his grappling skills are in transition, right? As he's yep. going from pass to. A uh, guy reversing him, he can grab onto that guillotine and, and submit guys. But he is not the best at just grappling from this type of position. But Rivera is. Rivera is really good off of his back and in all grappling sequences. How many guys do you know that could just just easily wrap up? Laredo's doing a really good job of, of tricking Rivera into the takedowns, right? The beautiful foot sweep before. There he just took a body lock, a bear hug, and just stepped across the outside and drug him to the ground. I like They're this not work, technical. Though. They're not technical, but they are effective. I like this work from uh, Rivera from the bottom, throwing these little, like, hammer fists. Just staying on him, staying active. Yeah, but he can't stay there too long with a guy like Figueredo, who's going to just, when he throws, it's not a little pop shot. It's, it's a deadly hammer fist from the heavens. Well, and Paulie, you cannot exchange strikes off your back with a guy on top of you, yeah. because he has the ability to generate so much more power than you do. Um, you're just kind of being busy. That guy's getting forceful, effective strikes off, even if there's one to your four and five. Very true. Rivera with active hits, however. Trying to get some distance from Figueiredo. Dude, just enough know. head movement. Shoulder shrug there by Figueredo. Nice work. Take the back. So Rivera to get his arm through. Man, he's got to get off of that other arm. Right, DC? He's yeah. got to let go of this and get the wizard on the other side. That He needs to shut down that side. I mean, uh, I think he, that was a mistake for Rivera. Uh, Figueredo's too skilled, right? He's too skilled a fighter to jump triangle on. Yeah. Doesn't happen very often. And that's why. You know, you're fighting the best fighters in the world. So it's like the third round, you're sweating a bunch. Yeah, ve very sweaty. Because these guys have been doing a lot. Oh, I like that elbow attempt. Hey, Figueredo looks much better in terms of his cardio. Yeah, he's been working hard on that. He knew it was going to be a big factor in this fight. Rivera turning it up here. Yep, yep. Beautiful by Rivera. Oh! There, that's what he needs to do. Oh, uh, he's going for it at least. You got to give him that. You give him credit for, and, and now it's on Figueredo to try to slow him down. Rivera's letting it all go. You can hear the urgency in the corner of Rivera. Nice job. Good head position as well. 
Oh, nice yes. one, too. Nice combination by Rivera. Oh, oh yeah, they're swinging. Bringing himself now in his third round is Rivera. Oh, Rivera showing a oh. heart. Oh, oh. nice job by damage. Rivera. That is how you fight when you're behind. If you're Rivera. Uh, oh, he went headlock. He went headlock. No. He has got to keep turning his hips here. Figueroa's going to take the back. He needs to turn into him. If you're Rivera, you got to turn, turn into him here. He's on top. Now he's oh. on top. Short time here for Rivera. Rivera's got to unload right now. Our attack of submissions. He's looking for knees again. The clock is becoming Rivera's enemy, however. What a great finish by Jerome Rivera. Really?